Over the coming weekend, a section of the old Berlin Wall in Germany will be transformed into an exhibition beyond the wall. The open-air installation will feature 230 meters of photos and stories. The installation was designed to keep alive the memory of the dividing wall put up by communist East German authorities in 1961. The wall fell in 1989 as a result of popular pressure and the decline of Soviet power. The exhibition will feature stills of videos taken from the western side of the wall in 1984 of East German so guard soldiers by artist Stefan Roloff. It will also tell the stories of people executed and persecuted on the eastern side under communist rule. A man who authorities accused of having a fetish, a woman arrested for receiving a postcard from the West, a woman whose apartment was bugged by the Stasi, Stasi secret police, and many more. One such victim, Mario Rowling, was imprisoned and interrogated by the Stasi after he tried to flee to the West to join his boyfriend. He offered his thoughts about the artist Roloff and the exhibition. He is obstinate. He tells truths that many people today no longer want to hear, for example, regarding the wall. The further away the GDR has become, the more positive it seems for lots of people who didn't experience it like we did, people who saw it from the outside, or people who went along with the system. I think the culture of remembrance does not belong to those people who adapted to the system, but rather to those people who said no and defended themselves.